YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshire Media One. I am Mark. Hello, I'm Jen. And together we are cheaper and better than the BBC. And I'll tell you now, we are more entertaining as well. We make people laugh. So there you go. So, what have we got today, Jen? Well, what we're doing is we're doing a Poundland pickup. Now, can you still... Challenge. Challenge, yeah, Poundland pickup challenge. So I'm going to be doing one at a later day, and this is Mark's one. Yeah. Can you still fi find anything in Poundland for, for a, pound. a pound? We'll soon find out. So we'll, we'll find out we'll... at Mark's pickup. Here we go. So, so I got these uh, Rydale Farm fudge, all butter. It's this kind of fudge I do like, and butter it's fudge. 120 grams. That was a, a quid. Pound. That one a pound. That's one thing. It's what they call luxury truffles. I don't know if it is or not, but they're... Do you know some of it? it oh, they're 110 it. grams. Mm -hmm. Bit weird, isn't it? 110 grams. And they was a... Pound as well. So that's two items for a quid. Now, this is a body wash. It's... It's, uh, yeah, it's just a body wash. It's insignia body wash. Man's body wash. Uh, zero on that. I do like, yeah, yeah, yeah things like this. I'd, I'd be okay for a bath. I've had a quick bath on that. And that was... A pound. That's three items for a quid. Um, Jen got me into biscuit aisle again. No, not my fault. Uh, you don't yourself? There's 12, 12 things in there. 12 packs of two little biscuits. Yeah, uh, and it's uh, 186 grams is that, so that's bis lots biscuits. of biscuits. And they were a pound as well. And that's what, how many items now? That's four items there so far. And then five items, another biscuit, biscuits, what Jem made me buy. But these are like sandwich biscuits, yeah. they've got cream inside. Jem insisted that we get these. No, I just pointed you them out to you that they were a pound. See what I mean? So there you go. So that's five items. I'm sure you'll eat them, babe. Well, I'll have a chance to. Um, <laughs> I got another... I've got Insignia Sport deodorant. That was... A pound. Um, you got Cadbury's Finger Minis. They... Uh, hang on a minute. And before we say it, what a quid... The nine six five grams. Nine little packs of sixty five grams. Yeah. What? Ninety ninety six point five grams. Five packs of nineteen point oh, three grams. Yeah, five packs. Five little them. individual packs. So in let, there. there you go. And they were a pound. They were a quid. Here we go again. I've got some more insignia, spark. Body wash. Body wash. A different fragrance, this one. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what fragrance that is. It just says sport, doesn't it? Yeah, it's just a sport fragrance. Because yeah. the, the other one was zero. Yeah. Um, and this one. Now, this is insignia. Was that zero? Yeah. Yeah, because you've got the zero, you got the sport and zero in both yeah, body yeah. wash and So I've got body insignia. Spray. Body spray. Zero in, in body spray. Right, so add a little bit of a twist to this. Now, there's a twist to this. So that's nine items all together for a quid. Now, I put in a... Now, Jen looked at me stupid. Why? I got this. Because on Poundland Challenge, you have to buy someone each other a present. So that's my present to Jen. So that was... A pound. A pound. Soft so, there's ten round. items that well, I've just pulled out of a Poundland bag for a quid. We didn't pay for this because you already had it. So, a pound. Now, anyone, if you want to have a go at doing this, then do so. It, it would be interesting to see other areas of Poundland, if you can still get things for a quid. You can, where we got them from... Um, but there weren't that much, was there, really, I for a quid? I couldn't see that much. But we went down every aisle... And yeah, I mean, obviously, I, I wanted some deo. I wanted some some smellies and things like that. And obviously, I've got some sweets, uh, chocolate and things like that, which she nudged me towards. 
He took himself <laughs> there. He bl- blame him. As soon as we walked in the shop, they were on the left hand side, yeah. and he just veered that way. <laughs> I was still coming in the door of the shop. <laughs> you were right next door to me. <laughs> but we did look down every aisle. Now, you know, some some stuff I had a quid and some are not. And then we went further into it. It, it just got more expensive, mm. really. One pound I, I mean, I mean the stationery, you, you could get things for a quid there and things like that. But, you know, I, I went down the route what I went down. So that's... The Poundland Challenge, well, I succeeded basically because I got 10 items for a quid. Um, so, if people want to do this challenge, simple rules is uh, no lower than a fiver, no higher than a tenner. So that's good, isn't it? So yeah. you can do a five pound or a ten pound. I did the ten pound one because I got five bickies. Yeah, you got carried away, didn't you? Yes, love, you did, didn't yes, you, you did. love? Yes, you did, love. Um, I'm sure you'll so, biscuits. So, so that's the rule. No lower than a five and no higher than a tenner. Um, you must buy... If if you're single, you can't do it. But if you've got a partner, you must buy your partner a present. Jen's got to buy me one. <laughs> As well, from the Pound Lounge. I can't get him shampoo. Mm. <sighs> well, you could. It's growing back. <laughs> um, Maybe a face mask. If they had them That's for revenge, pounds. isn't it? That's revenge, isn't it? Well, I'm we'll not. see what I pick up in my challenge when I get to do it. Well, you know what I like, so nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Avoid all chocolate biscuit aisles. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. No, you can get me some more fudge. <laughs> I know I'm not supposed to have it, but there you go. <laughs> so, that's the power line challenge. The rules are easy. Like I say, no more than a five, no, no less than a five, or no more than a tenner. And you go in and you buy your 10 items. If you've got a partner, you buy her a present, something like that. I, I, I bought Jen some roll-on deodorant because she mentioned that she needed it. So I got her it. And it's as simple as that. Uh, most probably. But like I said, we went down first aisle. And there were a lot of, quite a few things there for a quid, weren't there? There was probably Biscuit, a lot more the, you could have got. There were biscuits... What I like, but they weren't a quid, were they? No, there was some you know like I mean? £1.50. There was some biscuits less than a pound. So what would you say about 20% of that pound line shop is what you can get for a quid? Yeah, and under, because like I said, there were some biscuits there for like 69, 70 odd P. Yeah, true, true, But true. because you were doing it as a pound challenge, yeah. I didn't point those out to you because yeah. you were looking for pounds. Yeah, and that's the other rule is every item must cost a pound. Hmm. Um, See, even in the food section, you can probably get things. You can probably get things like tea bags, tins of things, and stuff like that for a pound. That's that's probably what I'll look at when I do my pound challenge. Look down the food section, and mainly that because obviously we don't need toiletries. I mean, you won't be doing this until until you get paid again. Probably maybe next week. So 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 she may or may not do it. Yeah, she'll do it eventually. I just thought I'd kick it off with what I got. And that's what I got. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, quite impressed, actually. I'm, I'm quite surprised to what I saw, what I could get for a quid. And you've got yourself some good toiletries yeah. there. So there's a good, well. a good 20% of Poundland here where you can buy things for a quid. Maybe more, because I didn't go into stationery aisle, I didn't go into pens aisle. Maybe I could get some pens for a quid and things like that. You just don't know. Mm. If you've got kids... It's probably good to look down that aisle because you can probably right. get art yeah. stuff, craft stuff for kids. I mean, in this pound one, they've got clothing and things like that. I, I don't know how many pound ones out, but they've got clothing yeah, you've in got this Pepin pound one. And that. So, yeah, I mean, so I most probably will be bringing you a pound one clothing challenge next time. It'd be more than a quid, though, unfortunately. Yeah, definitely. I don't think you'd get anything for less than a quid. No, but I think that would, I think pound one would be the cheapest. Area to get t-shirts. Maybe they probably. Well, I got that Disney one cheap. They're for probably you. the same. I got that Donald Duck, didn't I? Very, very similar prices to Primark a little bit in some. I mean, I got that Looney Tune one, pretty cheap. Yeah. Which I think is cheaper than uh, Primark. Mm. So I'll I'll try the product. I mean, I'm going to get certain things out of Primark and try them. So I'll get some joggers and things like that and we'll try them, see what they like. But I'll do that next time I get paid as well. 
<laughs> so there you go. So I will be bringing you a pound a, a, a pound land clothing challenge. So that's my video for this Friday. That's his challenge. It's not a taste test, but it's a Friday pound land challenge, and that's what I'm going to call it. A Friday pound land challenge, yeah. Yeah. So that's what I'll call it. So if you stay the end to his, I know I should put a warning at front of these videos. Tea and biscuits, you <laughs> must supply your own. Um, so please, if you like this, if you're still with us and you haven't fallen asleep, please give me a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Please like the video. Please subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell icon, hit all that will let you know when I'm uploading another video. Also, it also share your video to your, your friends and your family and to other social media uh, like X, Facebook, Instagram, and also use the comment section below. Let us know if you can find anything for a pound. If you found anything for a pound in Poundland, let me know. And what did you get? And what percentage do you think Poundland... Uh, I mean, I think at that one, it's 20% 20, 20 stuff is still a quid. So, which is good news if you're living on a budget sort of thing. Definitely, especially right. in these times of right. financial crisis. Yeah, yeah. Well, we are in a financial crisis. And it, it doesn't look like it's going to end any time soon cost of living and all that, you know, at least I'm trying to say that you can get, you know, your deodorant, you can get soap, the basic stuff you can get the pump need. soap, yeah. imperial level for a quid, and all that, so, yeah, I mean, you can get the basics, and you can get, if, if you fancy a biscuits, but you don't want to pay supermarket prices, then you go to Poundland, it's as simple as that, definitely, so, and crisps are pretty reasonable there yeah, as well, true, true, and, and drinkers as well, mm. so, that's it. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye, Bye. for now. Catch you all later. Enjoy the weekend.